Hey, good morning. This is Lakshmi Ayer with Sitare TV. Welcome to the final day of TICON 2024 at the Santa Clara Convention Center. We are here with Rajiv Ranjan, the Vice President of the State Bank of California, State Bank of India, sorry, California, and Usha Venkat Raman, who is the VP and Manager in the organization, also in the California branch. So, uh, Mr. Rajiv Ranjan, how do you like the Taikon experience? Well, it has been fabulous. Oh, you know, we have been um, in the Bay Area for the last 40 years. So this gives us, us an opportunity to um, bring ourselves to the notice of a lot of Indian entrepreneurs who are coming up and are not aware that an Indian-owned bank is here. So we are here, we display the products that we have and how we can bond together. We have had a good number of leads over the last two days and we are expecting a lot more today. And on the side, it was very nice to hear the speeches, you know, including NVIDIA chief yesterday and G Scaler chief. So we are, you know, availing or enjoying the whole thing, you know, in taking it in totality. We, we expect to benefit from this and the leads that we have got, we, we hope that um, the community will look to us uh, being uh, a wholly owned subsidiary of the strongest bank of India, which is largely owned by government of India. So we bring that and then we are FDIC insured here in, in, in US. So we, we bring that additional strength. So a lot of people are not aware and this gives us an opportunity to, to make it, uh, uh, to bring it to their notice. Hi, uh, thank you for the opportunity for letting us uh, speak to the viewers. As uh, Mr. Rajiv was mentioning, um, we have been uh, partnering with Tycon. This is the third year now and uh, we are uh, always honored to be a part of this um, huge event. It has been very successful for us. Um, we, uh, who are a subsidiary of India SBI, wholly owned by them, look forward to the opportunities that we can uh, partner with the organizations here to the extent we can and they can make use of the products and services with us. So it's a, we are trying to make this a win-win situation and I look forward to many more years to come here and uh, be a part of this great event. Thank you. It's very interesting because just the other day I was attending the panel on Exponential India and the growth explosion that's happening in startup funding and entrepreneurship. So how does this ecosystem work when uh, uh, say a U.S. startup wants to set up operations in India, do they come to the State Bank of India or is it also vice versa when the Indian uh, investors are investing in startups here and do you see potential for expansion and collaboration between the two ecosystems? So as you know that the Indian economy has come up uh, significantly in the last few years and um, the traffic is both ways, so a ton of uh, Indian companies which are opening offices here and likewise uh, there are so many tech companies that are opening offices in, in India and in Bangalore and Hyderabad's of, of India. So that is happening. Let me make this distinction that we are here, uh, American bank, as American as any other bank, owned by a State Bank of India and likewise in India we have a State Bank of India which is the premier yes. financial institution. So any uh, any entrepreneur will benefit in uh, associating with us, whichever way he wants, you know, either sending money from here to India or bringing money from India to here, or looking for banking relationship in India with the State Bank of India, or, uh, you know, looking for banking relationship here, which where we can take care of their U.S. needs. The whole purpose of having a bank here, which is owned by State Bank of India, is to help the Indian community grow and, and, and um, you know, to provide them business opportunities which they would otherwise find difficult uh, to. And we have a whole range of products backed by, you know, 200 years of experience of the State Bank of India. And we have, you know, um, uh, experienced bankers who also come from, from India and uh, for, a, for a limited period of tenure, and they guide us, you know, how to go about it. So we have a whole range of services in India, in the U.S., it's up to, up to the promoters how to come and avail, uh, avail of the services and, and products that we have. 
Would you like to add something about the products and services? Yeah, pretty much he has covered everything. Um, so we here, as he said, we are a U.S. entity. We are owned by SBI, but we operate as a FDIC-insured U.S. bank. Uh, yeah, uh, some work is in progress as to how we can partner with uh, startups and other companies that are trying to establish here. Um, so more is to be explored in those areas. But uh, what we are trying to do is to the extent that we can as a community bank, uh, we can try to see whether we can have any lending opportunities for them if they are registered in California for now and uh, also to see what, um, how we can help in their business to progress uh, with what information we have from them. So we are in exploring in those areas. Um, yeah, so uh, we look forward to more developments in this so that we can be more, uh, you know, interactual, interacting with the Bay Area companies. Thank you. We like to provide banking services in the same ratio that India has grown. You know, India has economy is now touching four trillion, yes. and we expect that you know our volume of association also will grow, you know, exponentially in coming years. Basically, because Bay Area is where a lot of tech entrepreneurs are, and and most of them are having some kind of relationship with India. Yes. So we like to, um, we would love to have some, you know. Um, some share in that pie. And that's what we are trying to, that's why we are here, we are making ourselves visible, Ushaji, I, and we are here to answer any questions. Plus we have a, a big head office in Los Angeles and, and there is a team there which, which is always available on phone to guide entrepreneurs. So through you I request all, uh, all those who are planning to have presence here in California to, to contact us so through whichever means uh, possible, through email, through phone and we are always available. Thank you. Thank you so much, Mr. Ranjan and uh, Ms. Susha. So uh, we have the State Bank of India here, and it's a very smart move to have an Indian bank operate in the US and help entrepreneurs, and we wish them all the very best. American, American bank owned by Indians. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> We are wholly owned subsidiary of SBI, so that makes us totally a U.S. bank, uh, which is owned by the India SBI. Yeah. But we are operating here as a California chartered bank, so it is registered in California. Yeah, something like an NRI who is a U.S. citizen. Correct. Yes, so but of Indian origin. <laughs> that's, that's correct analogy, I think. Yeah, so wishing you all the very best. Thank you, very Thank you much. so much. Thank you for talking Thank to you. us. Thank you for giving Pleasure. us the opportunity. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you.